Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 32 of Skyrim. When we left off, uh, I accidentally killed myself right over there. Uh, it was a little dumb. It was off the uh, hyperness of the birthday because I was recording on my birthday. Uh, yeah, it was yesterday, actually. Uh, I had a birthday stream. Uh, if you didn't make it, sorry. I did put out a notice on video while I was in the middle of the stream. Because I forgot to do that before the stream. But, uh... Those of you who did watch, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Got to play with a uh, follower on Tumblr and, I guess, a fan of me on here. So, you know, it was fun. It was cool. And, uh... Yeah, it's a whole bunch of fun. And I was just completely and utterly dumb that whole time. I, uh, backtracked through everything I went through. Got myself back here. And... Now I'm pretty much good. So now we're ready to get through this back in earnest. And a bunch of stuff. Cool. I'm gonna head up. I'm, I'm in a daze because I recorded New Vegas before this episode. And if you are going to see the episode before this one, I highly recommend you do. Because it puts a lot of things into context. Like my entire utter insanity. <laughs> uh, things just went south. Very hard. Extremely hard. Whoa. The texture there just completely disappeared. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, we're gonna go back up. And we're gonna continue on through Ustengrav. Uh, man, oh man, oh man. Anyway, how's y'all doing? Good? Good. Yeah, hopefully it's going good. Yeah. Like, the entirety of yesterday, the first, the morning of the whole day, it's like, my entire cold that I've been fighting for the last hour, like, the last few weeks, I mean, had been just waiting for a opportunity to take me down and it did so all of that day like an amazingly strong headache just knocked me flat on my bed for at least three hours I had to take a bath and was hocking up stuff for my lungs it was not pretty it was not pretty at all but you know I survived which is good <laughs> I thought the entire day, the 23rd birthday, this is when it ends. <laughs> okay, enough of that. Uh, whirlwind Sprint, that's what we're supposed to have, and we got it. Okay, what we're supposed to do is start running, and woo! Sometimes that is a glitch. It'll, uh, if you do it really quickly, you can get a second one going. Uh, it's... I don't know if it was supposed to be like that. I only just noticed it in my last playthrough uh, with Stray Cat going through this. Now that I think about it, yeah, he didn't actually get that word of power. But, uh, yeah, when I did this, it was strange how he was able to do that. Got a little whistle in that S there. Oh, there's a bunch of spiders up there. Okay, that spider went flying. And that one ran away. Oh, desiccated corpse. Well, that was worth the burn. I uh, really wish I had some sort of fireball spell, but until I get that. There we go. That works. Somewhat. Took nine billion tries. Okay. Now let's. Get a little sneaky. And launch. That did not work at all. Fuck. Hopefully that works. Yeah, that worked. At least for one of them. No, it didn't work at all. Shit. Do you guys know what you're doing? You're killing yourselves. Okay. That's a wonderful background noise. Uh, what I'm going to do is use some Magicka potions, because I never really use them that often. 
and they are just in the way now. Wonderful. Uh, there's a spider up there, I just know it. Yep, right up there. And booyah! That didn't work at all. Whoop. That barely worked. Okay. I've apparently been poisoned, so it's time to uh, start going crazy. Just poison the great sword before I even pull it out and use a fortify health. Okay, let's start bringing you down. Okay, wonder what size soul that one had. Frostbite Venom. I don't really need Frostbite Venom. Uh, let's see what size soul. It looks like a common, maybe? Grand? Did that thing have a grand, or was that from one of the uh, humans I killed? I don't even know. I'm a little confused, but okay. If that thing was a grand, I'm fucking... Caesar. I'm talking New Vegas Caesar. The one who was a Mormon. Oops. Fuck. Gonna have to bleep that out. Because <laughs> that's spoilers. <laughs> that's spoilers for what we haven't come across yet. I'm gonna have to bleep that out. Hey! I've reached the end of this to grab the horn. Do, 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 do. What? Mysterious note. Dragonborn, I need to speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood, and I'll meet you, a friend. Okay. That is a thing. And I guess we're going to have to do that. Let's just loot whatever's here. Okay. And these guys were already dead. Why the hell did they not deal with the ones that are were up in front? They dealt with these guys just fine. What the hell? Lazy. Ooh. Gold. A lot of it. Oh, bucket loads. Holy crap. What's in here? Uh... Frost Suppression, take that. Major Archery, ooh, that's something good to sell. Alright! This actually turned up something good after all. Take that, and I'll take that. Alright. Take those. Is there anything in those? Nope. Nothing useful. Time to get the hell out of here. Come on, let's go. There we go. Ustengrav. Well, we're sure getting a lot more progress than we were in the New Vegas episode. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, if you remember yesterday's episode, if you watched it, kind of got stuck in the middle of a uh, thing there with Legion. Today's episode will surprise you. Quite a bit. <laughs> and tomorrow's episode will be even crazier. <laughs> Believe me on that. Oh uh, man, oh man, oh man. There's all this. We're already good here. So now we have to head out. If I can remember the direction we're supposed to go. Don't think that's the way? Nope. Actually it is. I'm just dumb. Jesus Christ, a whole bunch of bodies over here. Bodies and weapons and things. Oh my. Let's get out of here because these things are useless. There we go. Although they later became the dedicated protectors of the em Emperor of Tamriel, the blades began their existence as renowned dragon slayers. Hmm. There's some backstory there for you. The smithing skill is used to create weapons and armor from raw materials or improve existing non-magical weapons and armor until you get the perk that allows you to fix them. Which we will be aiming for. Very soon. Alright, let's get up. And head on our way. Ooh. 
Wanted to catch that. Wanted to catch all of those. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, fuck. Butterflies, come back. Gimme, kitty. Gimme. Gimme. I'm like my fucking cat. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Let's go to Riverwood. Um. Yep. There we go. That's the stuff. Hostess. Sponsor. Not really. Okay. Okay. The Blades have long since disbanded, and the organization's few remaining members have gone into hiding. The Emperor is now protected by a special security force. I didn't get that. <laughs> Skyrim is home to the Nords, a fierce, hardy people that value honor and prowess in battle. Alright. That was my ring hitting my controller. Uh, there we go. Whoops. They are a lot. It is fucking midnight. Well then. Fuck me. Go in here. Alright. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's fun, fun, fun. I got good stuff for my birthday. So, you know, all in all, it was good. Alright. Rent the room. This is You're that visitor been poking around. Yes, I have. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. All right. I'd like to rent the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. What? But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Okay. Um. That's a thing. I'll just sit down then. Just wait for them to come in. This is the room I'm supposed to be in, right? Pretty sure it is. No. I'm dumbass. It was this room. I'm super dumb. Okay, sit down now. Oh! So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. Yes! I think you're looking for this. Yes, I am. We need to talk. Okay. Fine then. But can I stay here and listen to music? Or would I be able to listen to the music from where I'm going? Where are we going? Uh, ooh. Okay. Going to the bedroom now. Um. Now we can talk. What the uh, foo? Uh. You mind if I take your coins? Because it'd be kind of nice to have coins. Can I? Okay. I guess I'll do that. Take that. All right. <laughs> the Greybeard seems Whoa. to think you're the Dragonborn. You I'll look intimidating. You. You're the one who took the horn? Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. I guess so. Uh, what's with all the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. Ah. So, what do you want with me? I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. Okay. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. All right, go on. I'm listening. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part uh -huh. of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you for a very long time. Okay. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Fuck you! How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. I could have still killed you. Maybe. Shut up. <laughs> I'm not dumb. <laughs> You're dumb! <laughs> uh, why did you take the horn from Ustengrav? 
I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. Fair enough. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent, and not some Thalmor plant. Okay. You said the Thalmor are after you. Yes. We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. What? But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. Okay. Why are you looking for dragonborn? We remember what most don't. That the dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Okay. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Like it's a damn cookie. <laughs> yes, that's how I first learned I was dragonborn. Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. So what's the part you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. Oh. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead. Killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life. And I need you to help me stop it. What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I oh. figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Okay. How did you figure the, all this out? You should know. You got the map for me from Bleak Ball's Barrow. Uh -huh. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It so... seems to be spreading from the southeast, down in the Geralds near Riften. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. So, the wizard at Whiterun was getting that for you? Or both of you? Because he's crazy about dragons and you're crazy about killing them. Okay. Alright. Where are we headed? Kynesgrove. Okay. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Probably can't, but okay. Let's go kill us a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Oh, okay. I'll just give you some privacy and look over here. Ooh, katanas. I like them on my other guy more than I do this one because he's a great sword guy. Stray is more of a katana guy. Tyrong is a great sword guy. So... I'll keep it just Let's get on the road to look to cool. Whoa! You got into some pretty badass armor there. Well, it's leather, but that's the badass sword you got. That's all I'm going to say. This is a local favorite that one of the first songs I ever learned. Ragnar the Red. Uh, but you still have cool stuff. You go, and I'll follow. Alright, I'll take all of this, because this is all good stuff. Salt tile, Nordic barnacle, ice wraith teeth, slaughterfish eggs. I don't remember what all of them do, but I'm sure it's something good. I didn't even see what that one was. Uh, giant's toe. I know I can mix that with something to make a fortify uh, curry weight, which would be good for me, because I normally end up getting overweight really quickly. <laughs> uh, overburdened, I should be saying. But uh, I keep screwing that up. Hmm. What we will do is enchant this. Well, my enchanting skills are really coming along. And enchant that with the lesser soul. And have that to sell for later. Uh, enchant this garnet ring with carry weight. Uh, again, with the lesser soul. Just so I can sell it later, you know. Because they're good. Um, blade sword. Hmm. I plan on doing something with that for a follower. But until then, I'm just going to not enchant it. And we'll just head on along now. Head out to Kynes Grove. Which is... Windhelm. Yeah. I think she said that, but I was trying to remember in my own brain. Kynes Grove is this way. We can mm -hmm. travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Uh, let's split up. 
easier to move together. Turn the horned on gear. Then I'll head to the burial site. There we go. And because New Vegas is going to be the longest episode today, I think I'm going to cut this one here. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And, you know, share these videos around, comment so I can talk to you guys and we can bring more people into this community. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.